And today, Democrats are expected to vote to reopen the Agriculture Department for farmers and food stamps. They voted yesterday to reopen the IRS. The FDA says routine food inspections will not get done, but checks of the riskiest foods are expected to start back up again next week. We're talking about things like cheese, infant formula, and of course, produce. Right now, federal workers planning to rally to show the impact the shutdown is having on their daily lives. Paula Tutman live outside of the McNamara Federal Building downtown where a protest, it looks like, Paula, it's already underway. Yeah, yeah, and it got underway very, very quickly. We're talking about the American Federation of Government Employees. A lot of them work inside this building, and they do all kinds of things. They process Social Security applications, Medicare applications. Also, we've got people here from TSA. Just talk to one man. He's from the EPA. He says he may get a partial check, but because he has automatic deductions, he's not exactly sure what's going to happen to his mortgage payment, his car payment or any of his other bills. And that is a real concern for these workers who say, open the government now, they want to go back to work. Now, next week, people, you know, they may not be able to pay their bills, rent, or even eat. A lot of folks live paycheck to paycheck. So now something like this here, out of the clear blue sky, it hurts. Yeah, and, and, and keep in mind, you also have workers here, TSA included, who are essential workers. Basically, by contract, they can't not show up for work. And so they're not only working without pay, but some of them, because others are calling in sick, they're working overtime without pay. The irony, many of them work in border security. We'll have more today, obviously, today at 4, 5, and 6. I'll throw it back to you for now. All right, Paula, we will check back in with you. And of course, stay with Local 4 and click on Detroit for up to the minute information on the shutdown and, of course, today's protest as well.